Time flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? How is your baby suddenly not a kitten anymore? Now that you have an adult cat in your family, you'll want to pay more attention to a variety of things that could change. One that is incredibly important is your cat's body condition or how weight sits on his or her frame. I partnered with Royal Canin to let you know that after your cat has been spayed or neutered, we typically want to reduce caloric intake up to 30% after spay-neuter. In practice, this means initially reducing by 10 to 15% and then reassessing in a month to determine if further reduction is needed. This is so important as so many cats end up overweight or even obese in adulthood. Not only is this more uncomfortable and can shorten lifespan, it can also result in issues like diabetes and make worse the effects of osteoarthritis. One big risk factor for the development of obesity is the belief for so many of us that love equates to food. It doesn't have to be all or nothing. Here's a few ways to find a happy compromise. One, as your cat ages, make sure that treats are no more than five to 10% of their daily food intake. As our pets age, they might need a therapeutic diet that can help provide nutrients that are helping with other conditions the cat is facing. We want to make sure they are consuming all of those nutrients. Another healthy tip is to feed your cat with food puzzles. Not only will they have to move more to eat, which burns calories, but it activates their brain and inner prey drive for a more emotionally healthy cat at home. As veterinarians, we know your number one goal is to give your cat the healthiest and longest life possible. Make sure you talk to your veterinarian about your cat's particular nutrition needs at all stages of life.